Hello, welcome back to Phonics is Fun with me, Sarah Atherton, and Rusty the Rabbit. I'm a children's author and teacher, and today we are going to practice our phonics. In this video, we are going to look at another digraph. Remember, a digraph is where we have two letters that make one sound. This is ch. Can you see the letters that are in ch? We've come across those before, but when we put them together, they make that sound. What's that, Rusty? He said, make sure you're not saying ch. It is ch. Have a practice of saying that sound. Now we know what it looks like, we should have a practice of writing it down. Hopefully you've got something to write with too. So remember the two letters that make ch. We need to write those right next to each other. Here we go. So we're going to go round and then start at the top back over and down. That is ch. Keep practicing writing that sound. We're going to have a go at reading some words with our ch sound. So here's the first one. Let's say the sounds ch, o, p, chop. What's that Rusty? He said chop means cut as well, like chop something or cut something. So it can be a food chop, can't it? Okay, good reading, well done. Here's another word with ch. Let's say the sounds. Here we go. Ch, a, t, chat. What does chat mean, Rusty? He said it means talk. He says, I like to chat. Yes, you do. Okay. Rusty, can you think of any other words with ch? Oh, yes, chick. Well done. What's that? Oh, Rusty says he and the chicks work together on Easter Sunday. That's right. Yes, they do. Okay, shall we have a go at writing the word chick? So what are the sounds that we can hear in the word chick? What's first, Rusty? Yes, that's right. It's ch. So remember, two letters, one sound. What can you hear next in chick? What can you hear? Very good. You can hear i. And at the end of chick. Excellent listening. Could you hear the k sound at the end? And that's another digraph. Here we go. Two letters, one sound. Okay. As always, we should read the sounds back to make sure we haven't made any mistakes. Here we go. Ch, i, k, chick. Fantastic. Can you think of any other words, Rusty? Oh yes, chip. Well done. What's that? He said he'd like a chip for dinner. Well, perhaps you'd like more than one chip though, Rusty, eh? Okay. Should we have a go at writing it down? What's the first sound then in chip? Very good listening. It's ch. Here we go. Ch. What's next in chip? What is it? Very good. It's i. And the last sound in chip. Fantastic listening. Yes, it is. P. Okay, let's say the sounds and read the word. Here we go. Ch, i, p, chip. Children at home, can you think of any other words with the ch sound, either at the beginning or the end of them? Have a look around and see what you can find. And you can play a game of ping pong like this. So one person says ping. The other person says pong, and then we take it in turns to say a word with ch. Ready? Chin. What's yours? He said chair. Very good. Chest. What's yours? He said cheese. Interesting that he always comes up with food words. Anyway, you get the idea. That's how you play the game. Well, we hope you have lots of fun with it. Keep practicing and remember, Say the sound and write it down. And Rusty and I will be back soon for some more Phonics is Fun. Bye.